this is the complete address of the ROM. In order to use this ROM, you'd have to download this from here, XDA Developer. You'll find this ROM in at XDA Developer in the Hermes section, Windows Mobile 6. This ROM has been created by FCW. I take no credit for this ROM. It has solely been created by Mr. FCW and I am just promoting it. Here you will find many ROMs. This is the HD ROM. Here are the, some screenshots. Now let's move to the ROM that I'll be using right now. It is the Titanium. Not this one. Here, this is it. 6.5 Titanium Edition. This is the address, Rapture. Once you have downloaded the ROM, you'll find a RAR file, unzip it and you'll find these two files. The ruusign.nbh and ruurapper.exe. This is the file that we'll be needing. Connect your Hermes to your computer using the USB cable and after sync. As you can see, I've already connected it here and here and uh, once you double click on this file it will take you to the RUU screen which is this before starting you should know the uh, the version of your SPL bootloader mine is 2.10 and if you don't know it you can auto detect it using this option well now Proceeding further, I remember all these points. It would be good if you have already understood these points and you should read them. Here, it is verifying the information from the PDA. This is the point where it will read the current version of the ROM. This is the PDA. It will take few moments. The current ROM I'm using is Home HD and click on update. This will update the ROM from Home HD to the current ROM. Press next. The progress will be displayed on both the panels, the PDA and the home screen. Here as you can see on the PDA it has gone to the hard SPL mode. this here you can see the version of Olipro and this is the progress bar the progress bar will be uh, shown on both the computer screen as well as the PDA well um, the well as you can see I have skipped through the progress to save uh, time 95 97 98 99 and done hundred percent completed now we will wait for the PDA to reboot and here it's booting Congratulations, you have your ROM update is now complete. Finish. Uh, this is the boot image uh, from the earlier ROM I was using. You will probably not be seeing this CRC's ROM. Mm. The ROMs usually take a uh, few minutes to load, so we'll skip this part also. You need not worry. Here, yeah, the ROM has loaded. It's ready for the first time use. Mm, let me take out my stylus.
this is the screen calibration well this ROM is quite fast as compared to the previous one yeah done now configuration will take place At this, this point, uh, the ROM is installing some other softwares which might be including in the ROM. Right now, as you can see, here. Well, we'll skip through this part. Here, the phone has booted. Let's see, settings, system, oops, everything is working fine till yet, let's see. Here. Well, that was to it. It might be possible that you may, may have been prompted that this version of Windows expires within 7 days. Well, there is, uh, I hope there is soon uh, a way around this. For that, you'll have to wait for FCW to come up with something new. Okay.